There was this young man in those days, the early days of this ministry. We didn't see him in fellowship for about three weeks. We were having this Friday weekly fellowship. And so he showed up. And I saw his mustache like this. He came to greet me. How are you, sir? I said, fine. Emmanuel, where have you been? Oh, no, I've just been busy. I said, no. You are gone. You are gone. Others would say, no, 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 it doesn't matter. Maybe it was just busy. I said, Emmanuel, you are gone. I mean you that I'm looking at, you are gone. Then he broke down. He said, I'm sorry. I've even started on alcohol. Three weeks. How many weeks? He was away three weeks. He has traveled so far to the city of alcohol. <laughs> Within three weeks, he has lost steam. The fire is gone. Within three weeks of being away from Jesus, I don't care what job you do, sir. There are MD of banks who must resort to their drinking joint every day. And they do that religiously. In fact, you ask the bar woman, is he not coming today? No, he's, he's coming. I mean, there's no way he will come. <laughs> and then they call him, are you not coming? No, we just had a meeting, but I've just finished. I'm on my way right now. I'm there any moment from now. Now, they would drink on credit, sir. But they must go there every day. The truth is, they were out of fellowship. They lost their steam. And they lost their values. Sometimes our team went to some hidden place ministering the gospel and they ran into this armed robbery, you know, uh, camp. And one of them said, the bishop should never know that I'm here. I was an active member of the church in Kaduna. That is the armed robber confessing. What has happened to him? He lost touch. He lost his team. He lost his value. There are those in the court. They go to their court meeting every day. But then you have the believer. You see, you see um, the issues actually is such that I have to be uh, around, you know, um, the business just trying to pick up. So I'm just trying to Put things together. Um, you know, I've just been appointed the MD CEO, so there's a lot of things, you know. So for the next three, four, maybe six weeks, I may not be able to come to church <laughs> because I will be at the office trying to sort things out every Sunday and I have to be there very early in the morning. So I can use the freshness of the day to get the job done. He's explaining his way out. <laughs> Amen. The next time you ask him, he has joined the Bunny Court. It's gone. You know, I've been around this thing for long, so I can tell you these stories. I've been in it before most of you are born. You won't fail in life. Amen. Please don't treat God anyhow. So he doesn't treat you anyhow. The side you put to God is the side he puts to you. Thank you so much for staying till the end of this video. Please don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. We appreciate you being part of our community and look forward to sharing more content with you soon. Thank you so much for your time and God bless you.